Guys, it's that time again. Diamond Select Toys is back with Series 8 of their Ghostbusters Select line. We're talking dark-suited Peter and Winston, as well as also Slime Blower Ray Stance. Let's crack them open today on Ghostbusters News. Now, before I crack those three action figures open that I've been waiting so long for. So long. I'd like to let everybody out there know that if you'd like your own set of Ghostbusters Select figures, Series 8, or Series 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, or the upcoming real Ghostbuster figures that make up Series 9 and 10, we've got a link right down below in the description for you. Pre-order slash buy the figures we're talking about today, pick up some of the ones you're missing, and pre-order Series 9 and 10, which are going to be real Ghostbuster figures. But back to Series 8, this is the final wave of Ghostbusters based around the film series right now planned by Diamond Select Toys. But of course, that could change in a couple weeks. We've got San Diego Comic-Con right around the corner, so who knows what could be announced. But let's not waste any time. Let's crack open the We're Back Dr. Peter Bankman figure, or also known as the Dark Suited Peter Bankman figure. Now, the first thing I want to point out is check out that side of the packaging. Yes, this figure has a brand new head sculpt, and it looks oh so good. Turning the character around to the front here, you're going to see Peter Bankman in all of his dark-suited glory and all the accessories he comes with. We're talking things like the Proton Stream, an MT-500 radio, a Santa's hat, a ghost trap, and a variety of gloved hands. Alright, so I'm an impatient one. I've already got Dr. Peter Bankman out of the package. There he is. Check him out. Now, one thing to note, I've already changed the hands over to the dark gloved hands. I just prefer them more than the, the bare hands. That's, that's a personal taste there on, on my end. Now before I dwell on the suit and the proton pack and all the outstanding detail on this figure, let's compare this Peter to one of the ones we've previously seen in the line with the, the older head sculpt. Now I don't think I'm alone on this, I didn't mind the first head sculpt that we saw from the original Ghostbusters film, but this one looks so much more like Bill Murray. The hairline, that smirk, man, I'm just waiting for him to ask me if I'm menstruating right now. Now as mentioned already, he does come with his charcoal gray suit. He's got the name tag, the belt accessories, the elbow pads, the no ghost patch. And of course, one of the biggest things when it comes to Dr. Peter Venkman's detail, his pants are untucked. Now let's turn old Billy Murray over and check out that Proton Pack. If you've seen any of our past reviews, you know exactly what to expect with the Proton Pack and wand. It's identical to all the other past ones we've seen in the line, and still looks flippin' beautiful with the detail and all the little sticker tags. And remember when I mentioned that he does come with one of those Christmas hats? Well, let's put it on, old Venkman, right now. As always, these hats are molded directly for that character, so it fits perfectly. And maybe after a take a look at Winston, we make it like a group photo with all four Ghostbusters rocking those Christmas hats. Stay tuned. Now, before I move on to Winston, one interesting piece is Peter does actually come with a ghost trap, and this is actually kind of a new mold, as the ghost trap this time around is open. There's no accessories or add-ons to put inside of it, at least as of yet, but it's cool that we've actually got a variation on the ghost trap we've seen since Series 1. Coming up next, we have got the Everyman Winston Zedmore. Now, Winston's accessories are very similar to what we saw with the Venkman, as once again, he comes with a Santa hat, an MT-500 radio, an open ghost trap, a proton stream, and a variety of hands. But behold, one of the coolest accessories we've seen yet, the slime scooper. Yeah, this is the little thing that Ray uses when uh, he's underground, uh, under the streets of New York City, and comes face to face for the first time with the river of slime. So cool. We've got old Zedmore out of the package here, and much like I did for Bankman, I've already switched to the, the gloved hands, because once again, that's my thing. And once again, all the detail in Zedmore's suit is pretty similar to what we saw with the Bankman. Differences including things like the name tag and, of course, the pants being tucked for Winston Zedmore. Zedmore's proton pack is identical to what we saw with Bankman. And I've already been gushing about that slime scooper, but let's get a better shot of Winston holding it there. Once again, probably my most favorite accessory I've seen so far in this line. But that could change once we get to the Ray figure. And before I move over to that Ray figure, let's take that opportunity. Let's take a look at all four Ghostbusters in their dark suits, Christmas hats on. Let's see what kind of a display that makes. Now seriously guys, have you ever seen a better decorative Christmas display than this? This year I'm not even bothering with a Christmas tree. I'm just going to put Ghostbusters on a table, gifts underneath, done. Now rounding out Series 8, we've got the heart of the Ghostbusters, Dr. Ray Stance. Now as we've already mentioned, this Ray is a slime blower Ray Stance. So of course, therefore he comes with a slime blower instead of a proton pack. He comes with an attachable slime accessory, 
replaceable hands, much like the other two figures, an MT500 radio, brand new molded jar of slime, and the best part, a possessed head. I seriously can't believe it's taken this long for us to get a possessed Ray Stance action figure. I'm so excited! And here he is, guys, out of the package, Slime Blower Ray Stance, very much like what we saw uh, in a previous series with the Slime Blower uh, Winston Zedmore. I mean, come on, look how awesome these two look together. Hey, while we're at it, can somebody queue up that, like, awesome scene from Ghostbusters 2 with, with those two and the Slime Blowers? You know what I'm talking about. It's slime time. <laughs> Yeah, that's the one. Now here's a great shot showcasing the upper half of the race dance figure, including the chest harness, the slime blower gun, and speaking of the slime blower, let's turn around and take a look at those awesome tanks. Diamond Select Toys slime blowers continue to look fantastic with all the detail, hoses, and labels you'd expect. Can I also see that scene where they hose Peter McNichol down with the slime too? Hose him. <laughs> Now to pop the possessed Vigo head on, all you have to do is take the Ray head and yank it off. It does take some force. And then you have this. I know I gushed about that slime scooper earlier that came with Winston, but seriously guys, this alternate possessed Ray head is one of the coolest accessories we've seen yet from Diamond Select Toys Ghostbusters Select figures. I love the Ray figure and I love this head so much, I kind of want to buy another slime blower Ray just so I can have standard Ray and possessed Ray on display at the same time. I, Ray, and Vigo shall rule the earth. Be gone, you pitiful husband. Now! <laughs> Now one thing I haven't mentioned during this entire video is the display pieces. Yes, for those unaware, each and every figure in the Diamond Select Toys Ghostbuster Select figure line comes with a display piece. You collect every single figure in series 6 to 10 and you can make the Ghostbusters Firehouse, well, the front of the Ghostbusters Firehouse. And ever since I posted that I got these figures a bit early uh, on social media, the one underlining request I've had is people want to see what the firehouse looks like at the end of series 8. And oh my god guys, it is huge. I mean, just take a look at this. Now of course there's still a top to be made, as well as a base that looks like a sidewalk. And those will come with series 9 and 10. And as I mentioned before, series 9 and 10 are going to be figures based around the real Ghostbusters. I am so pumped to get my hands on series 9 and 10, the cartoon animated versions, Egon Spangler, Winston Zedmore, Ray Stance, Peter Venkman, and of course animated versions of the Stay Puff Marshmallow Man and Slimer. But I think I'm actually more excited to finish that amazing Ghostbusters Firehouse display piece. Once again, let's take a look at it one more time. Look, let's look at the size comparison here. I cannot wait to finish this thing. It is going to make one heck of a display piece here in the collection room. So guys, let me tell you, you don't want to sleep on series 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I mean, you don't want to sleep on series 1 to 5 either. We built that amazing Ghoster's Temple when we put those sets together. So if you'd like to buy this series and pre-order series 9 and 10 or buy any of the past ones, once again, we've got links right down below in the description for you. As always, I'd like to thank Diamond Select Toys for making these unboxing and reviews possible. And I'll see you right back here next time on Ghostbusters News. No one dies tonight. Run for your lives, alright